What a night we expect it to be. We are live at the CompuBox Academy. I'm Todd Grisham. And watching this live with me is Johnny Nelson. Hi, Todd. Hi to everybody back home. It's time for our tale of the tape. Larry Holmes. Watch out for that reach of 206 centimeters. He's also 191 centimeters tall and weighed in at 103 kilos. Eastern assassin Larry Holmes, a man that beat Muhammad Ali but never has really gotten his just due, criminally underrated. Let's see what he's got in store for us in this one. He is the greatest, Muhammad Ali. Watch the footwork, watch the hand speed. No one does it like Ali. As soon as the ball goes, don't blink. That fight could be over. So now let's go into the ring for the official introductions. Here's the classy Jimmy Lennon Jr. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. Fighting out of the ring. Not too many seats to be had in this arena as the hype continues to build for this showdown. You know, look at the stars, ex fighters ex-champions ringside. You've got future opponents, past opponents. That's what these fights do. That's what these venues do. And we're underway in round one. Counter-punching. Fighter's not shown us much defense at all. It's bombs away! That left counter was perfectly timed. You're not going to see a lot of finesse and skills from this guy. He wants to bury his forehead in your chest and pound away. You are fighting the swarmer. Be smart. Be sharp. Concentrate, but you've got to be confident. Do not dance his dance. Because that swarmer, once you do that, you give him a man a chance that shouldn't have this. And he misses with that jab. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. He threw the hook, didn't land. Skill for skill, tap for tap. She's like a match made in heaven. Nice job landing with that right hand counter. Do you believe this? Which fighter will say no moss? Just misses with that big right hand. Still swinging with nothing left. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. And a round that seemed like eternity for them finally comes to a close. Every second, every minute of this fight is... And there's the bell to start round two. Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. Now he knows he's been hurt. He's going to come out and put the pressure on. He's going to throw the kitchen sink at you. You've got to be ready for that. Don't fight fire with fire. Hold him off. Be smart because he's going to try and put you under pressure. He knows your legs have gone. He knows your head's not cleared. Be sharp. Let's see if these two heavyweights decide to exchange bombs early or decide to box a little bit. We've got a couple of big units here, so I'm expecting power. You're going to have it, Simon. You're going to have drama because when these guys slow down, that's when the punches are going to land. He misses with that jab. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. He got out of the way of that right hook. 
very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. Nice counter shot. This fighter's certainly not going to outthrow their opponent by any means, but they will, when they hit, be a lot harder. I've seen certain fighters that can depend on just their power alone. Forget tactics. They know the second they touch you, it's done. That's where the confidence comes from. How nervous would you get when you know you're facing a... Despite what the judges' scorecards read, there are no losers in this one. You know that bell was sweet music to his ears. Needs a knockout without a doubt. Needs to go out there. Let's get it started in round three. That corner has got to find a way to get some momentum behind their fighter. They've had one minute to recover. Now they've got to bluff it. They've got to bluff it. They've got to come out now and style it out. Get on the back foot. Jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then put the pressure on. Catch and shoot with the left counter. Good job. This is one of the best rounds I've seen this year. Nice counter punch. When we talk about a fighter having power, don't just look at the head punches they throw. Look at the body shots. That can be the real difference. Power. That power might be the do or die. That power might be the, the, the equalizer. A left hand lands. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Good right hand. seen all the famous boxing movies, the training scenes, the gym work. That's what it all boils down to. Who's going to have more endurance? Midway through the fight, if you are tired, this can be the loneliest place in the world. If you cheated, now we're going to find out. This round could go either way. Ten seconds to go. Is down big time on the score. The bell sometimes it could be the sweetest sound. Here we go in round four. Who's going to land the first big shot? Safe to say that last round was a nightmare. Let's see if we can turn it around here. That was a tough last round. Now you've got to make sure he doesn't put it on him. That's what he's going to try and do. So tie him up, hold him, lean on him. Don't get drawn into a fight. Not yet. Not until your senses have come back. When someone punches that hard, you don't want to trade shots. Right punch. In the early rounds of a fight, you'll see two boxers feel each other out, test each other's power, and I think this boxer has decided I can walk through anything that lands. Work the body, frustrate them, take the mind off the chimp, take the mind off protecting everything around that. Work the body. Used it's knockout or bust for both of these fighters. And finally, Muhammad Ali goes down.
So they'll make it up, and this fight continues. Which one of these athletes is going to be the first to get rocked? Final 10 seconds here, and I think he knows who's won this one. Let's see how the game plan changes after that big knockdown. And there's the bell for round five. He got knocked down in the last round. Let's see what he can do here. Todd, listen to me. If I knock somebody down like that, that round, you know this round coming out? He's getting everything, everything full battle because I know his legs are gone. So this, you watch what's going to happen. If he doesn't, I'll be very, very surprised. He couldn't finish him off in the last round. Let's see what this has in store for us. Perfect counter lands. When you're a power puncher, you're not as concerned with how many punches you throw. It's about how many you land and how hard they are. Sometimes when you get in there with someone that's so powerful, you've got to think him. You've just got to be smarter than him. You've got to be like a little fag in a pickpocket in him. Good counter left hand there. Nice exchanges from both men in this round. You can tell he's stronger, but he's not faster. Totally impressed. You know what? you got skill. you got... Oh, my goodness. I admire these guys. Good left counter that lands. Off the charts action from... Is this the beginning of the end for Muhammad Ali? Shot, and down goes Ali! Final 10 seconds here. It's probably a round he'd rather forget. There's a counter shot. It's not over till it's over, but that knockdown is going to be huge. I love the response, though. Got back. On to the sixth round. You see how he bounces back here after getting dropped in the last round. What a knockdown. You know in the corner now, they're saying, when you get out there, jump on him. Do not give him chance to breathe. Bully him, throw him, push him down, punch him in the back. Keep letting the shots go, because you know they're on shaky leg. They're a, a nuts here, away from getting stopped. Great counter right hand there. How nervous would you get when you know you're facing a big puncher like this guy? Oh, Larry Holmes just got dazed. He needs to just land one big shot, but can he do it? Just one punch away from getting the momentum back. Punch scores. Beautiful counter punch. These two fighters are made for one another. We wanted action, and they are giving us action. You've seen all the famous boxing movies, the training scenes, the gym work. That's what it all boils down to. Who's going to have more endurance? When you've got two fighters that are absolutely shattered, what gets you through willpower, calm, because if you panic, you get desperate, if you get desperate, you make mistakes, if you make mistakes, you get knocked out. And the counter left. You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. And, there's, and finally, Muhammad Ali goes down. Heard that right? 
tonight, ladies and gentlemen, a knockout victory and one of the biggest surprises of the year. A knockout victory? That is Todd. Did you see the shot? That's not a knockout. That's an assassination. What a shot.